city portion of the review. This is, well, not quite a video game. It's a mini crane game, actually. Now, first off, crane games are cool, right? This is why I bought this. Crane games are awesome. Don't deny it. Okay, so, what's so cool about this crane game? Well, you can fill it up with whatever you want. Top part is nya. And no, you can't stick your hand in it to get free prizes. The opening's too small. Let's close that back up. So, you can fill it up with whatever you want. I actually went on, um, what's the website? Orientaltrading.com. Sounds kind of girly, but they have, um, what is it? They're basically multi packs of toys and little candy, stuff like that. Stuff that teachers would get, you know, like to reward kids for, like, doing their homework or not beating up little Billy. So, I picked, like, this multi set of little toys. There's, like, rubber snakes and wristbands and, um, little finger puppet things. But the, uh, I actually kind of got these when my little cousins were here back in July. They loved this thing. They cleaned out like half the <laughs> half the game, which isn't a problem for little kids because um, it comes with these fake coins that um, go into a coin slot. Imagine that. The science is amazing. So it it does know when you want something. There's a little sensor in the prize chute here, and when something blocks the sensor, it um, counts as a win. Now it plays music the whole time. Here I'll show you. It plays music the whole time, and when you win, you get like an applause. But the music can definitely get annoying, especially when you're running out of time, the music gets faster, and it's just the same carnival song looping over and over again. You will hear it in your dreams. But what I took the liberty of doing, it's a good thing I work at Radio Shack, because since we carry switches, I just cut a hole in the plastic here, and install a switch on the speaker. So that way, I can still play the game, and no music. You could tell, yeah, that the crane does move kind of slow, but it's a, it's a toy, you know? So, let's try to win something really quick. So you've got three different joysticks. One controls forward and back, one controls left and right, and the one on the all the way on the right controls up and down. Now when it goes down, the claw automatically opens up. And when it goes up, it automatically closes. So I'll go for this little frog thing in here. It moves faster with fresh batteries. It's still got the same set of batteries in here that my little cousin's drained. Okay, I got some frog thing and a wristband, which I don't even want. This isn't stuff in here that I want. It's just the idea of having these little novelties. I'll drop it in. I win. Yay. And it caught the sensor, so the game shut off. So, I got a little frog. They're those things where you press down on the back here, and they kind of... I hit the tripod, sorry. They kind of jump. Amazing. Like I said, I don't like really like the toys in here, but it's just the idea of, you know, having something like this. I saw an Oriental Train, they're going to have Halloween stuff, and, um... I'll probably fill it up with candies or something. The candies worked out great in here. Um, really depends on what you put in here, though. Um, I got this assortment of uh, Willy Wonka candies. It was like Sweet Tarts, Laffy Taffies, and Nerds. They were those little boxes of Nerds that are like this big. They are really hard for the claw to grab, almost impossible. They have to pretty much be on top of something else uh, for you to be able to pick it up. But this little thing is fun, though. I got it when it was on sale at my local Target for 15 bucks. Normally they go for 20 But, um, I'm a real fan of crane games, so... You know, I had to pick it up. It doesn't really constitute as crane game practice, because the rules are a little different. In this, you can move the claw up and down as much as you want until time expires. Whereas a normal crane game, you know, it can only go down once and then that's it. So it's not, you know, don't buy it thinking like you're going to practice and kick ass at the arcade crane games, because it's not really how it's going to work. But it's fun. Little kids get a kick out of it, and deep down I'm still a little kid, so that means I like it.